episode of Naked Dave's Backdoor Access, with all the pun intended. With me, I have the stick people. Say hi, guys. Hi, hi guys. guys. <laughs> hi, guys. So what we're going to uh, do real quick, is we're going to ask you, you guys, we're going to go around, uh, state your name and what you do in the band. Well, Frankie Anthony, I'm the visual timekeeper. Any relation to Michael? No. Okay. No. I'm M, I play guitar. I'm Bernie, I play guitar. I'm Steven, I cause trouble. Uh, and I sing. My name is Billy Close, I play bass in the stick people. <laughs> the only cool one in the band. That's, That's East Coast, baby. East Coast, Billy Close. <laughs> So you guys are passing through, passing through Phoenix, yep. Arizona, and uh, you're playing tonight with Agent Orange. Agent right? Orange. All right, yep. cool. Um, how's this uh, passing through gig going, or sh small tour going with for you guys? Great. People in Arizona are real friendly. We went to a restaurant the other day, Morning had breakfast, star. and it was there. Yeah. Much different than L.A. Let's Much different. Let's put it to you that way. Yes. Dude, I'm from Southern Cal, man. You well, <laughs> I live there too, but you know. <laughs> Uh, so have you guys done the whole circuit, like Hollywood, Vegas, all that kind of stuff? I uh, haven't done Vegas. We've done, in L.A., we've done Wisconsin, we've done, what, Texas, Iowa, we've Texas. Done, we've done D.C. Chicago, D.C. We, we've, right. we've, we've done a bunch in the Midwest and some in the East. We're just kind of building up in splotches everywhere we go. Cool. Yeah. All right, so a little stick bird told me we're missing a member tonight. Yes, and Mike uh, Stone, formerly of Queens Reich and... Peter Speed Chris. X. Speed X, that's Speed right. Nick Cantney's his Chris. band. Peter Chris, too, actually. Peter Chris's band. Yeah, he did play oh, with yeah. Peter. Early, yeah. early in Peter Chris's soul. Cool. Career. So, is he just MIA? Got what? a venereal disease? He's got a tree. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Well, again, maybe, but no. He, he's, uh, he's just, he, was, uh, he was just honestly busy at the moment. He was uh, he was already had uh, plans put ahead of time, and this was uh, this smaller tour was kind of a spur of the moment thing. But um, we got our buddy M here to come in and fill in, and cool. it, you know it's just another one of the stick people with us, and uh, that's just been working great. Cool. So okay, you guys got a new CD coming out. New CD. Yep. You're you're uh, signed with Universal. Yep. Universal Bungalow on a, a small label called EFM. EFM. Uh, yep. Okay. Um, so what's the name of the new CD? Madness. 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 All right. Tell me about the CD. Well, we started recording it in what? Two thousand eight. Uh, 2008. 2008. 2009. 2009? Starting Is this another Chinese recording. democracy? Yeah, yeah. Oh, hopefully, you know. <laughs> Actually, us three, uh, me, Bernie, and Steve started recording in 2008. We started just doing songs. Well, we started writing. We started oh, writing. Yeah, we had, we, had a, we had a couple of song ideas, yeah. and we all just kind of collaborated and put things together mm -hmm. as we were going, trying to see what Inspirato on the moment was kind of like, and it led to a CD. Yeah. Okay. It led so, to a CD. Well, we finished it up in 2011. Okay, cool. And who's produced it? Uh, we had uh, the fortune of working with uh, Dito Godwin, who has worked with the likes of like you know Peter and Ace from Kiss, right. Motley Crue, Great mm -hmm. White, Warrant, the Jane Lane just before he passed. Um, no doubt, as they no say, doubt. no doubt, yes, yeah. no, no doubt, doubt. and Gwen yeah. Stefani. As they say, the list is long and distinguished. Yes, yeah, it, is, it is definitely <laughs> definitely has some things on the wall from them. That's for sure. Yeah, well, that, that that's cool. And you got a supporting video coming out as, as well. Yeah, we yes. got a video coming out, uh, a song called My Everything. Okay, and the video should be coming out. Uh, probably towards the end of March, beginning of April, sometime. Right. And directed. that's that's going to be the release date of the album, also. Oh, okay. Directed Univer by Universal. Kevin Universal hasn't given us a direct date yet that they're going to release it. Right. So hopefully, oh, soon. we'll get we'll get it soon. It'll be soon. But we definitely want to give a shout out to Kevin Custer, who just uh, yeah. brought in a great crew, and just uh, it was yeah. a it was a moment to remember. That's for sure. That's cool. Uh, all right. So signed with Universal, you got the new CD coming out and uh, a video to support and i'm sure you're going to go on tour oh to yes support, to oh yes support everything yeah um another again another stick bird told me you might be touring with a couple of different bands you've kind of been throwing around yeah yes. Who that? who's that all american rejects that was that was mentioned um I, I'm not at liberty to say another another band right God. now because that's actually being worked on in the middle. We, we won't tell nobody. Just yeah. just yeah. We won't tell nobody. That, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing ever makes it to just the internet. Everybody no, on YouTube. no. no. <laughs> I'll, I'll, the whole I'll, world. I'll, I'll just put a little delete bar and we'll do that. <laughs> We're going on tour. That's right. Uh, try. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll leave the beginning of the, the first word in the end. The Jex. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Like the Wayne World scene. Okay, I gotta ask this. You guys came in yesterday, I met you guys yesterday, and you're, by appearance, a very diverse looking group. Yeah. So. What, what do you mean by that? <laughs> We'll talk about that later. <laughs> no, it's 
just, you know, like, you know, everybody in my band, we all have long hair tattoos, you know, we all look pretty much the same, you know, and I mean, you know, obvious long blonde hair, short brown hair, you know, and it's very diverse looking. Uh, so how did you guys end up meeting? Because usually the same type of people run the same place. <laughs> I'd say, you know, we, like, like uh, Frankie was mentioning before, he, Bernie, and I met, and, you know, we started writing material and forming material. And through uh, through Dito. Through Dito. Actually, through Dito. Yeah, we met. We all met through our producer, Dito Gunn. Uh -huh, and yeah. he, uh, started in turn, him. brought in Mike Stone, because uh, mm -hmm. Mike had just left Queen Trade. Okay. And, and Dito and him had worked with Peter Chris. So that's ago. how they knew each other. Oh, yeah. That's years true. And then that's yeah, how we yeah. got uh, we got Billy Close. We were uh, we were member shy, and we needed, uh, we needed some thump in the band, and... Uh, Mikey's like, you know, I know this guy, you gotta get him, he's got the attitude and the chops and... So you didn't have to put an ad on Craigslist? No, no. it was one, one guy, one guy only <laughs> yeah. in the there. And then we hunted him down. Yeah. 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 Cool. yeah. And now he's I mean, only. literally hunted him down. <laughs> yeah. 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 The spear, the arrow. Yes. The I had style. Hey, there's Mike! <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, I'm actually looking forward to hearing it, and hopefully you guys will send me a copy. Oh, oh yeah, absolutely. Definitely. You know. absolutely. Uh, definitely. So, we'll go into a few things here. One... You guys, from talking to you yesterday, were already, oh no, we got so many stories. Oh, we got it. <laughs> I mean, he, you've been a band for you three years. You can just years. interview him and he's got t tons of stories. Yeah? yeah? So it's all like, you know, wild women, half naked, <laughs> you know. No, most of them involve police. No, fully <laughs> naked. <laughs> oh, fully naked. Yeah, I'm sorry. Most fully naked. <laughs> most, most of them involve police and his driving. <laughs> that's, that's the first half. That's the first half. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. white dust on the dashboard? <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> no, uh, we, we've had some stories. I mean, like, you know, you go to different places. Like, uh, uh, I know one story in particular we can tell. Uh, we were in Des Moines, Iowa, and we're about halfway through the set, and... Um, you know our rock shows, there's certain certain birds out there you could see, sure. cer certain ladies that happen oh. to catch your eye, and um, this this chick, God bless the doctor whoever gave her these. <laughs> you because, mean that she paid to give her those? Uh, <laughs> however she's paying it off, I don't care, because I, the, the guy is a damn perfect surgeon. Uh -huh. She... She stood on top of this guy, and these two solar panels just were just, just everybody. Universes. These two universes just came out of nowhere. I think I met her on the cruise. <laughs> so, yeah, you know, no, what? I mean, they were like the size of a soccer ball. This chick, this was like, oh. Like, every, at one point in one song, everybody in the band caught a glimpse of this chick, and like, in the middle of the song, there was just a lull. <laughs> then back into it and say, like, the vocal stopped, the drum stopped, the bass guitar, we all just went, oh! <gasps> and we went right back into it. And then after the show, you know, I'm handing out guitar picks and whatnot, thanking people for coming out. And, she, you know, she's handing out, pick, hand, you know, hand out for a guitar pick. I'm like, oh, that's easy. And she's like, I want them all. I'm like, but well, i got to give out some other ones. She's like, the, you got to give them to me. I said, well, sorry, I can't. She pulls out the the bazookas and, and just like and like it just like it rained and drooled from my hand. Right sure. I had no more guitar picks and... Uh, and see, and every guy in that line went, yeah, okay, I get that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah like, two, two, two dudes just... No, I mean, we understood. Okay. Yeah. Two dudes understood. next to her are just like this. <laughs> They're just like, they just like, it's like they just saw, you know... God. Yeah, pretty much, man. Did it go, oh! <laughs> yeah, I had the Wayne's World moment in my head just going like, oh, swing! <laughs> but yeah, that's, that's, a, that's a, like a, a little light story, but other ones involve like... Uh, Getting pulled over late at night, and you know, they involve, they involve his his driving. So, yes. so this why are you time? such a bad driver? So we're driving. Well, you know what? The the thing about it is, is that is, I haven't. Is had it hard to drive when you got a woman in front of you? <laughs> 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 you know, it's hard to you know. <laughs> this was a thing of beauty. So Billy's driving, and we're in the car with Stony, and Frankie and Bertie are in front. They're in the equipment uh, truck, okay. and we're driving behind them. Or no, 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 equipment. We were driving in front of them, and all of a sudden we see this white van going, <laughs> and we're like, was that, was that Frankie and, and Bernie? Well, we don't know. So we didn't see him for a long ways. And all of a sudden, way up in the distance, we see these police. The police said, and we all go like, wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> because he just got a ticket like a couple weeks ago at another game. Yeah. So we see the True way story. in front, we're, we're like, we're like, do you, do you think that could possibly be? Nah, nah, he's learned his lesson. It couldn't possibly. And as we get closer and Well, Stone was the one that said it. Yes, he did. Be so, he did say it. so was it like Buford T. Justice? Ah, <laughs> uh, pulling you over. And, I, and, as, and as we go, and as the first time, as we go by, we see Frankie sitting there. <laughs> Police officer over there, and we we just lost it. I mean, we were laughing for. 
probably like 30 minutes. Hopefully, you were just go. speeding. I was just speeding. Okay. Yeah. And it was cool. He let me go. With the, Odometer wise. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, that was exactly. only one of the two times that Frankie got yes. pulled over. One of the two times. Within just a couple of is, weeks. Is it in always the same area. on tour? No. Yeah, 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 it was at home all the time. No, 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 it's just been when we were on tour. It's only <laughs> happened, I swear like, to you. It happens in the Midwest, it's freakish. Like, it is. Everything uh, happened there, like... Des Moines, I uh, know. You, you, you know what that is, right? Wisconsin. I got pulled over okay, by well. Barney Fife. Wisconsin is in It's because the guys are sitting in, in their Illinois. car, they see a van full of long hairs going and going... He sure had a pretty mile. Yeah. <laughs> All of a sudden, I oh my God, music. I hear banjo music. <laughs> Paddle faster. <laughs> <laughs> Never understand a TNT about a life and you 